Welcome back to another episode of Stars in the Stars with me, Naomi. We're coming at you with the galaxy's latest inane celebrity slander, so buckle up and prepare to drop your IQ by at least 30 points. Is this the galaxy's sexiest Corvette? Playblorg magazine readers seem to think so, with its naked hull voted top on a recent Hot 100 poll. It's the first non-organic model to feature on the magazine's cover, following last year's winner, Mercedes Romero. Wedding alert! The Habsburg royal family have confirmed Prince Harren is to marry the mysterious extra-dimensional Prethering Queen. At the announcement ceremony this morning, the Queen looked stunning, wearing a gorgeous royal tiara above her giant eye, all while tucking her perfectly manicured tendrils into the base of Prince Harren's skull. Harren spoke to Stars in the Stars this morning in an exclusive interview in which he stated, I am overjoyed. From the moment my queen penetrated my central nervous system, I knew I had to marry her over my sister. Once we have ascended, I will grant all my landed titles to her. She will make an excellent ruler. The lesser species will be pitted against each other to distract them from the coming storm. Wow, so romantic. We wish the happy couple all the best and can't wait for what's sure to be the wedding of the century. Uh-oh, someone called the Interstellar Fashion Enforcement Bureau I'd like to report a crime against my Orbis optical implants. What is Kim Calrissian wearing? The troubled socialite appeared at a recent gala event dressed only in toxic kelp. To make matters worse, she suffered a wardrobe malfunction when some of the kelp burned all the way through her torso. Ouch, hopefully someone at St. Frontier Hospital can put her back together soon. Well, it looks like you've made it to just under two minutes of actual programming, so now it's time for some commercials. Stay tuned, when we come back we're going to be taking a look at the latest pet craze, sapient primitive species. <laughs> 